Hey everybody out there, it's Patrick from Building with Dad and Riley. Thank you for joining me for another Monday vlog. Um, here's a good joke for you, this is the running joke around our house. What do I talk about every week but never comes? Is it my mocks? Is it the baby? It's both. Uh, <laughs> I've been making that joke just because um, the baby's still not here yet. We've been waiting and neither is uh, my mock is not finished either. But um, we've been waiting and waiting. Uh, this week I actually kind of stopped waiting and you know, went out and planted the garden and did a bunch of stuff that I had to do. Um, and still no baby, so I'm glad I didn't waste it and just sit around and was waiting for the baby because we thought literally it was going to come two or three weeks ago. <laughs> but um, she's only six days or, or seven days now past her um, due date um, and we will have a baby this week. Uh, if she does, if she makes it to Saturday, she'll be induced on Saturday. And Saturday actually happens to be a really special date for me. It's um, uh, my best friend who unfortunately passed away. It's his birthday. So if she makes it that long and she's born on that day, it'll be even more of a special day to me. As far as our, our channel out there in the YouTube community, we've had a lot of good mentions um, this week. And I don't even know if this, the one from Zany Bricks might have been even last week. I didn't catch up on his city update right when it came out. But of course, um, I went over there to check it out. And sure enough, uh, me and Riley were in his uh, new city, which is called New Hell. Um, it was awesome. He nailed it. You know, put a, he didn't have my face, but he put a Darth Vader mask on. And since Riley um, has her hand cut off like she's Luke Skywalker, it's just <laughs> really awesome. Um, perfect mention of us in his city so we're really excited about that um, as well as I saw on Instagram that Riley and I were both um, made by Maniac for Bricks so that's really awesome as well and then um, we were also made by well I've only heard this a rumor of this because his package got delayed but no more bricks um, made our sig figs as well and we just missed out um, being on the, he made a live stream mock, and I guess we were going to be on that. Um, once again, Riley equipped with her lifesaver. He was going to give me a 50 cal, which is awesome um, <laughs> to have in legal form. But anyway, um, so it was really great to have those mentions and the six figs being built. I haven't, I really need to get on building my own six figs of all these other um, great YouTubers out there, which is in the works and will happen. Just really, it's going to be a really slow process for me as I'm also trying to spend a lot of money on my actual mocks and the city and getting all that stuff done. And we we're also mentioned on Beatrice Bricks' channel. She is doing a Q&A Friday every week. So we had asked a question about how does she, be, how does she feel being a female in a um, hobby that's dominated by males. Now, Mike from Three Brick Friends was um, harassing me, saying that my channel is 50% female. Uh, Beatrice Bricks is 100% female, and his, of course, is you know 66% female. But it is no, no matter how you know. There's a lot of more girls coming onto the scene, which is great. Um, but it still is more guys in this in the Lego hobby. Um, so I just with having Riley being young um, and Beatrice Bricks, I'm not too sure how old she is, but I know she's definitely older than Riley. Um, but yet she still wears short legs. Um, but I was basically, I just wanted to know from her opinion, and I did gain a little bit of knowledge inside because um, I did learn that she doesn't share her hobby with all her friends. And you know, being around at a young age, she doesn't feel comfortable with doing that. That's fine. Um, but it just gives me a little insight to what a um, a younger girl um, that's a little bit older than Riley, you know, feels about Lego and sharing, you know, that hobby. And last but not least, uh, J.R. Brick, who was the winner of, which was the number one winner of the subscriber giveaway contest, he did a review on the package that I sent him. Um, so that was really nice of him to do. And then I realized that he has a city, um, he's got some mocks, he has some really good ones featuring some lights. Um, he's got working trains in his city, so go ahead and go over there and show him some love. He's an international bricker. He is pretty new to YouTube. However, he's been doing videos for I think I saw at least five months now. But go ahead and show him some. Go over there and show him some support. I'll link his channel down below. Also, um, my subscription base is is climbing pretty um, rapidly in the last um, week or two. Really excited about that. If you're a new subscriber, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, Monday Vlogs is where I, obviously I review everything that's happened last week and what's going to be upcoming. Um, but speaking of up, not only is our subscription up, 
um, but our morale is up here as well, at least with me. Um, I'm very excited about, I'm getting a lot of good work done. I'm setting goals and um, uh, accomplishing those goals. And just for this week, I just wanted to get um, another big um, mock order, oh, ordered. <laughs> and I also wanted to get the stickers done for the call machine. And I haven't ordered the last part for the call machine, but I might actually do that before this video is even uploaded. But so I'm making a lot of good progress um, the sticker. Thanks once again to Uncle Mark. I'll show the sticker somewhere, probably over here, um, so you can see it. Uh, this will go on top of the claw machine. I might even do include two stickers and put one on the back as well. But, um, you know, I really appreciate Uncle Mark for getting that done for us. It looks really professional, really nice job, uh, really great logo for the claw machine. But anyway, uh, the mock is getting just more and more closer and closer and closer to being done. Um, the first structure is literally one sticker and one one by three gray bar from being done. For some reason, I only have one one by three gray bar and I really need another one. Um, and I actually, I might uh, change some things on it and make it a little bit more detailed. We'll see how that goes, um, see what kind of parts and what colors I, I can get because it has to be kind of some, some specific stuff um, that I'm looking for to add on to this mock, but it's almost about to be done. The, uh, the bigger structure is um, still far away from being done. It's almost completely done on the outside and even the inside, but what is left is the detailing, um, and I have to work on that and get some things in here to make sure the details are perfect. And last but not least are the live streams. I was able to attend Nick and Maria's, which uh, happens every Saturday at 5. Um, unfortunately, I had a green screen. As soon as I popped up, my YouTube screen was green. So I did a lot of troubleshooting. I figured out it was just my computer needed updating. Um, so as I started updating, I went and then continued watching their stream upstairs. Unfortunately, that means I, I couldn't get on. Um, I fixed it before the evening live stream, but as I got onto the evening live stream, I was able to show our mock, which was um, awesome that we got to do that. But uh, it's, my computer started freezing up, and there's cats fighting in the background. I have two older uh, male cats, and they normally get along, but for some reason, because probably because I was on a live stream, they decided to fight really loudly. Um, so I had to mute myself and then I took my you know screenshot off and then eventually I just exited out because it was freezing up and I just went upstairs once again went upstairs and I continued um, watching the live stream for pretty much a long time I think I made it to almost the end um, but the live stream was awesome this weekend um, glad, very glad for Zany he had a very successful live streaming a lot of people on um, a lot of stuff going on there was the live build challenge which is really fun to watch um, I really want to participate in, however I feel, I just don't have enough brick <laughs> the, to be able to make um, a mock with, I'd would, I would feel I would be back and like taking apart the jam factory and everything, which is something I don't really want to do. And it was just nice to be on the live stream with so many other great builders, there was some just unbelievable mocks. I mean, I can't even mention all of them because I know I'll probably forget some ones that were really, really cool, but they were all just awesome, awesome mocks. Um, there is one reason I figured out one of the reasons why we didn't do better is because we didn't share our song. We had a song that went along with our mock and maybe that would have scored us some extra points. Um, but probably still wouldn't have made us win though because the competition was so good this week. Alright, so Riley is here joining me for a Monday vlog. It's the first time she's been on a Monday vlog. Say hi Riley. Hi. Wave. <laughs> but anyway, she. who are you dressed as? Nadia the water elf. She is dressed as uh, Nadia, the water elf. I didn't even know that uh, Mama was up there decorating her face and making her a water elf. But we were here to sing our song. This is a song we sing when we're playing um, about the porthole and everything. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the elves. They have like a little theme song. I'm not even too sure of the words, but it goes something like, something like, Magic is here and the wind feeds the fire. But we sing... We sing a different version. Magic is here as we rule the human world. <laughs> and that's our song because the elves are, of course, trying to cross over the porthole and rule the human world. Um, now, Dada also, uh, Minifig Dada sings a song. What does he, what does he sing? It's like the same song, but when we rule the elf world. <laughs> so it goes, magic is here. 
as we roll the elf world. <laughs> but those are our songs. I think we would have scored more points had we put those into our video. I had just forgotten them. And definitely if Riley was wearing her um, elf costume. But that's all we have for you this week. I hope you join us next week for next Monday's vlog. Hopefully you have more progress uh, to go or more progress I can report on. But until then, we'll see you later. Say bye, Riley. Bye.